what I'm what I'm thinking about is next next week, Chris, the 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 what the drama show. I'm going to pre-record it and go to a technology breakfast. Oh yeah. Tech Exeter have a a techie breakfast. Do they? Every month, the first Thursday of the month. Yeah, I prefer a cup breakfast. Oh well, you you you'd be all right. You'd have a cross or and a yogurt or something like that. Okay. But no, they won't go. They, I mean, they, get, they. I'm not sure. I don't think. I don't think they will do you sort of Le, bacon and eggs and things. You don't think their budget would stretch that? Well, part. perhaps we should offer that, Chris. Perhaps we should have a, a phonic networking event. Yeah, perhaps. With a, but this is for high-powered people who are going on somewhere else. Oh. Could we offer a breakfast that started about 12 o'clock? Well, that, <laughs> that's not breakfast. It's not breakfast. That's lunch. Oh. Well, I'm just thinking of when we'd prefer to be up and about. So you can ask the producer. All right, we'll ask the producer. But what I was going to ask him, which you might have a view about, if I, if I want to have... Um, a steam village in the middle of Exeter. Yeah. I don't see why you can't have a village in the middle of a city. We did because there was one. You, you were the one of us who met the Dalek. I was. The BBC was so enthusiastic about this idea of a steam village, they sent a Dalek to give advice and encouragement, and demonstrate that. Art could be part of science, not Scientology, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. That could all be a context for art to exist. Yeah. And um, I think Beck, Baf, is it BAFTA? Somebody was there who gave awards for games. I think it was BAFTA. Okay. I'll take your word for that. Uh, we might have to research that a bit more, but essentially, um, it was a it was a very good idea to have a whole section of bet that was not only STEM but also STEAM. And I don't know um, how to how to describe it exactly, but I. I think I would just say that the the innovation hub is a techie space on a Thursday. Okay. Even though they might be a bit arty as well. Just to just to make life simple, if we say that's an art that's a, a techie space and the art centre is an art space. Yeah. And the city has all kinds of journeys and connections between the two spaces. Mostly involved in sitting in cafes. Not having breakfast, obviously, if, if Tech Extra have already sorted out breakfast. Yeah. But it might... Well, you can have two. You can have another breakfast. Yeah. Oh, OK. <laughs> well, that's all right, then. Yeah. So, look, next week, what I'm saying, Chris, is that I'll probably be back here in time to start the Wild Show. Yeah. Because that's very important. It's part of our planning. Yeah. Our flexibility exists, but it's within certain limits. Yeah. So that um, you may turn up at 10. You may turn up at 5 to 10. You may turn up at 10 past 10. I would have turned up earlier today, but I had to pay a little visit. Well, yeah, that's, that's better organised before the show starts than at some random... Juncture. The yeah, though that's possible as well. We have methods for everything. Yeah. Um. Let me think. I think I've got another. I've got the. I've got this in the right. In the right CD player, Chris. I believe. Okay. To play some Joss Stone. And then I shall loosen up the other CD player, and play something from somewhere else. But I think I think we've sorted out how to how to describe the city, even if it's not in, exactly true. Today it's wet. Wet. 
Yeah. It's only showers, Chris. Don't worry about it. It's quite heavy showers. No, it's just one shower after another, that's all. 